Hi everybody, today we are doing Hands and Feet, part of Critical Thinking 2, Unit 4. New words, digits, digits, joints, joints, bend, bend, wiggle, wiggle, scratch, scratch, Itch, itch, pinch, pinch. Be on the lookout and listen for how many times you hear the word hands. Every day, our hands and feet work hard. Our hands and feet do many things. They are used from the time that we wake up in the morning until you go to bed at night. We use hands to eat breakfast, to hold a book. We use our feet to kick a ball. We use our hands and feet every day. Think about all that they do. Hands and fingers are used in many different ways. Here is a hand. We have a thumb, an index finger, a middle finger, a ring finger, and a pinky. Hands, well, they hold a fork when you eat. They hold a pencil when you write. They tap letters on a keyboard when you're typing. Hands help you throw or catch a ball. They even scratch you when you get an itch. There is something special about each of your hands. The thumb. Why is this special? A thumb can work with your fingers to pinch, pick up, or hold on to things. If I were to pick up my marker, I would need my fingers and my thumb to pinch and hold on to. Try to pick up a pencil without using your thumb. Can you do it? I'm sure you can, but it might not be too easy. It might be difficult to write. Your feet and toes work hard too. Your feet hold your whole body up when you stand, and your feet help carry your body when you move. Feet carry you from place to place, whether it's going to school, going home, or walking in the jungle. They help you walk, run, skip, and play. How do you use your feet? Imagine moving around without the help of your feet. How would you get around? Would life be more difficult? Your fingers and your toes are called digits. I'm going to say that one more time. Digits. How many digits do you have? Well, if we're counting our fingers and toes, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten fingers, and I have ten toes. So in total, I have twenty digits. That's right, you have twenty. There are ten on your hands and ten on your feet. It, there are so many bones in both your fingers and toes. Joints in each finger and toe allow you to bend them. You can bend your fingers at the joints. My finger has one, two, three joints. Wiggle your fingers. Can you see how well each part of my fingers is moving? Now wiggle your toes. Do they move less? or more than your fingers. That's the end for today. Thanks for watching.
Goodbye.